This tip's in response to a question I just got, which is how do I stop my lead arm from getting all jammed up into the follow through in that position we commonly refer to as the chicken wing? Well, the lead arm in the follow through really isn't the problem. The problem is all the stuff that's going on before. When your golf club is approaching the ground too steeply and crashing into the turf, that lead arm is naturally gonna wanna fold up to help you avoid that crash landing. So if this sounds like you, here's a really simple way to get you out of this basic problem. What I want you to do is start by making some swings up above the ball, little baseball swings back and through. And you'll notice very quickly, when the golf club doesn't wanna hit the ground too hard, your arms will extend and then fold up back around your body just the way that they should. From here, what I want you to do is realize that if you're coming into the golf ball a little bit steep, chances are your downswing is a little bit over the top of your backswing. I want you to flip that around a little bit and modify this little swing by feeling a little loop where the downswing drops a little bit underneath the path that backswing is traveling on. Once you can do that a couple of times, bend forward from that knee high swing to about an ankle high swing, and then bend forward just a little bit more from those hips until your golf club can brush back into the ground again. If you can do that, walk in, feel that little loop, and swing away. If you put yourself on film, as long as that golf club isn't crashing the ground, man, you should notice those arms extending and then folding up back around your body just the way that you're looking for.